Hi, how are you? How are you and you and you? I am an empath and I am here working with people in an empathic uh, awareness of all of the good that surrounds us <coughs> and of all of the pain which people are going through. And I am feeling the pain right now that you are going through. Believe me, I feel the pain that you are going through. I feel the pain of sickness. I feel the pain of depression. I feel the pain of, of not being able to find the occupation or job you want. I feel the pain of you not having enough money. But you can have that being, doing, having power of money. You can have all these things that you need. You can have the answers. <laughs> and I'm here with the answers. And as such, I am sending out those answers now. I pray moment by moment, hour by hour, day by day for answers to all the problems of the world. I've been researching problems and diseases and illnesses and psychological difficulties for years and years and years. I have a medical degree. I have other degrees. I have uh, books on every subject. I've been researching these things for years. And uh, I uh, understand every need that you have, and it bears in upon me. And I feel that as an empath, and I well, as such, I address those when I go to the Supreme Being, the Divine Mind every day, and lift up my countenance and my hands to Him, lift up my eyes into the hill. I tell Him about all of these things. I say, my God, there is hungry people across this world. My dear God, my dear Father, do you see the hungry people? My dear Father, do you see the people that don't have the sustenance in every way or the money that they need? Do you see the people, especially, I always pray, do you see the people that are depressed? I don't want anybody being depressed. Yeah, it's been years and years and years since I even experienced that, but I can re still remember that uh, any even a day of depression, you remember the rest of your life. I mean, it's just terrible. So uh, I pray now, again, I feel those people out there that are having uh, bouts of depression and how painful it is. And so I'm praying every time I go to the Lord in prayer, I have a long list of people that I pray especially for <laughs> To lift them up, especially if they're in the ministry of some kind, or as they're an empath or, or, or whatever, they, uh, an empath of some kind, because I know they're especially uh, amenable uh, and especially uh, uh, are able to. They're, they're especially, you know the word I'm trying to think of, uh, susceptible. They're especially susceptible to having depression just simply because of the ministry wears on them. Uh, uh, doing the empathic work wears them down. Uh, you know, all of us could get wore down by all the depressing news. And so there's so many things that wear us down and make us depressed. And so... I am especially tuned into that. And now if you have a special bout of depression that you can't overcome just by listening to these videos, make sure you comment down below here and let me know what that is that uh, seems to be making you depressed. And maybe I can uh, uh, give a, a, make a special video uh, to address that particular situation. And I like to make videos about incurable diseases too, because like I say, I have a degree in diseases and all, and in pathology and so forth. And, and so uh, I, mean, I like to, to make special prayers about particular incurable diseases. And I like to make videos as to how to, how to overcome incurable diseases. And so you put all that in here and you tell me what's going on in your life and, and it, it will help you just just uh, getting in touch with me because we have to circulate this power. We have to I circulate it to you, then you circulate it to others. And as we all circulate this power, everybody is lifted up. Oh, yes. Don't tell me they're not. Everybody is lifted as we begin to circulate this thing. You know, there's an old saying about money increases when you circulate it. 
And so you have to constantly be out, you know, uh, searching ways to invest properly. And so you keep your money coming in, but you keep it going out and that circulates it and that increases it. And it's the same thing about this prayer life and the same thing about this empathic life, the life of an empath. The more people they contact with their empathic powers, the more that circulates and they get greater empathic power. The more they circulate their healing power, the greater healing power they get. And we can begin to become healers. You can become an empathic healer. You can become a, a, a healer of a of particular types of diseases. Some people can have a greater power to heal cancer than they do any other disease. Some people can have a, a power to heal diabetes more than any other disease. And so we can gain all these powers and we can gain all these joys and we can begin as the more we do that, the more empathic power we'll have, the more healing power we'll have, the more joy we'll have in our life. And that very joy will heal us even more. It's a whole cycle, and it's a whole spiral, cycle and spiral, upward, ascension upward, and that the more we do like that, and the more that we circulate of every kind like that, the more that comes back to us, and the more our, our powers increase. And so we have to get involved in circulating. You need to get involved in circulating your healing power, and in circulating your empathic power, and you have to contact other empaths, and you have to circulate with them, and so let's... Uh, Let's think about all these ways which we can do this now. And I will talk to you again. I, uh, it won't be the last video, believe me. I will, I will go into this deeper and deeper and deeper as I go along. So uh, uh, be encouraged. Be encouraged now. And know that you're on your route to getting out of doubt right now.